Hey YouTube, thanks for watching Junkworks Garage. Well, recently um, I watched a video of an unfortunate incident about towing somebody out uh, that was stuck. And uh, they were pulling from the hitch, the ball hitch. And the receiver hitch broke off, went through the window, and killed the driver of the car. Um, which led me to a few more stories and incidents that I found of this happening. And I'll be honest with you, I've done it. Uh, I pulled my wife out of a snowbank using the ball hitch of my, or the receiver hitch on my Explorer. And uh, knowing what I know now, it scares me to death. Like, you know, if, if the same thing would have happened, it could have uh, killed my wife. So in that aspect, I went on to Amazon, I found this. Now, no, it's not the most expensive one, um, but these have ratings. And first of all, I wouldn't trust the ratings on much of anything, but you need to kind of do math. And uh, this one says anyway that it holds up to... So, I will put the information in the screen. I'm not sure what the numbers were on this, but with the vehicles I'm using, uh, maybe if I was trying to pull my truck out, I don't know. I need to do the math. I need to do the math on this. There is a mathematical equation you can do. I don't know it right now. I will do the math before I start really doing much of this. But I do plan on doing some more off-roading here in the future. I used to do it all the time, and quite honestly, I, you know, several times I've pulled people out. I, I don't know how many times I've done it actually with the ball hitch. Usually it was, you know, hooking it to the bumper or a tow hitch that was actually already on the vehicle. Something that, or not a tow hitch, but uh, something that was made to pull that was already built into the vehicle kind of thing. Um, but anyway, this one comes with your shackle type hitch mechanism that goes into your receiver uh something i did like about this that even some of the more expensive ones didn't have was you can put it through this way or this way so you can you know have it in your hitch this way or that way um and there was all kinds of colors and stuff i chose black it does have also a, a red one of these that can be changed out from this one here um uh, colors don't matter that much to me until I get a paint job going. It's got the hitch pin. Um, I'll be honest, this hitch pin does not look super quality. But, uh, you know, it should hold up to the weight they say. But, you know, buyer beware kind of thing. It also has this right here. Uh, which some of them didn't come with this, but this basically goes up through somehow. I'm not exactly sure how yet again. I got a, it didn't really, it doesn't look like it came with any instructions, unfortunately. Unless they are on the box somewhere. Um, but this basically, when you put this in, it somehow tightens this up so that you lose the slop. So... Uh -huh. I actually need this for my wheelchair lift. Um, I've been wanting to try and figure out a way to get that from, because it bounces around a bit, and that, that wheelchair is really heavy I put on there. So, regardless, I just thought I would show this to you. I will put also a price somewhere in the screen here of what I paid for it. So, yet again, it came with that. It came with the pin, hitch pin. It came with this uh, tightener piece. I don't know what it's called. I think it did say on the back. Uh, Anti-rattle hitch tightener. I came up with just about as good a word. Um, the spare one of these. And a bunch of foam, which... If any of you watching my videos, I tend to take this stuff and use it for my um, tools and things like that. So, regardless, I will actually probably put this back in the box the way it was until I'm ready to use it, throw it in my truck, and that'll be a, a safe place for it for right now. Alright, well, 
all of you stay safe out there, please. Please be aware not to pull anything out with your ball hitch or receiver hitch that you would use for your trailer to tow your trailer with. Uh, it's unfortunate that people, so many people have gotten hurt this way. All right. Thanks for watching Junkworks Garage, where I'm proud to say I'm a jack of all, and obviously, master none. You all have a good one.